Hey guys, welcome back to Let's Play Pokemon Fire Red. Now, in the last episode, we got Fly, and now, uh, we're gonna go do something. But first things first, I'm gonna go heal up my Pokemon. So I did that. And now you're gonna wanna go into the, uh, the game corner. And now we're going to inf infiltrate Team Rocket's base. So, what we're going to want to do is go up to this guy here that's guarding the poster. I'm guarding this poster. Go away, or else. Yeah, what are you going to do? You got... You, you suck at battling. There's nothing you can do. But anyway, he has Eradicate. It's level 20. His, the lo levels in this place aren't really that high, because you could have come here... When you first got into the city, but I went ahead and did the gym first. I don't know why, I just felt like it. So, his second Pokemon is a Zubat. And our newly evolved Raichu should be able to take it out with a Thunderbolt. And that guy was pretty easy. So, like I said, you can do this before the gym if you want, but I just want to do the gym first. No, no reason, really. Dang. Whatever. Team Rocket might be discovered. I better go tell Boss. What? Team Rocket's been stealing uh, Game Sharks. They're using the walkthrough walls cheat. No. That is illegal. You can't use cheats. They use cheats and they still suck. Anyway. This is Team Rocket's uh, hideout. And there are a lot of t Team Rocket grunts in here. I'm not going to fight all of them just because there's so many. But, uh, I'm gonna fight some of them, so, just, uh, just for the experience. So this first one is Eradicate. Same as the guy outside. Sh should be just as easy to take out with a Thunderbolt. But this one survives. This is like a Super Eradicate. But luckily all it used was Tail Whip, so we'll go ahead and kill it with the Slam. And he has another Eradicate. I'll go ahead and stay in, I guess, because I need to train up Sparky. I'll go ahead and use Thunderbolt. Oh crap, I didn't mean to. Oh, I missed too. I didn't even mean to click slam. But whatever, I'll go ahead and use Thunderbolt this time. And he uses Quick Attack, that's just great. But, uh. Alright, this one actually died, even though it was the exact same level. But we beat this guy. I don't think I even had to beat this guy. Boom. But, uh... Yeah, so we come down here, we can get an item. It is a... Escape rope. So, uh... I don't really need that, because I have Dig. And it basically does the exact same thing, but you can use it as much as you want. Who are you? How did you get in here? Well, I... I, uh, clicked the switch behind the poster. It's kind of common sense, but... Great, he has a drowsy. Psychic types can really be a pain sometimes, if they, like, get out attacks on you. And I really don't want to even deal with this right now, so I'll just go send out uh, Needle King. And, oh, it's going to be super effective, but it probably won't do that much. Yeah, only 15 hit points. And I'll use Shadow Ball because Ghost types are strong against Psychic types, in case you didn't know. But it does. It's a pretty good move. It's also super effective against Ghost types, which I don't know why a Ghost type move would be super effective against a Ghost type. But we're not gonna find that many Ghosts yet. But uh, it's still pretty useful. And his second Pokemon is a Machop. And since it's a Fighting type, I'll use Aerial Ace. And here we go. Critical hit. Didn't even need it, but I guess it's good. <laughs> I don't know. Ow, beaten. And, uh, well, we can't even go down here yet. So I guess the only place you can go is down, because this is actually going down, not up. But I'm going to go ahead and try and skip this guy. I don't really want to fight him. So these spin spin pads things are kind of weird. I mean, <coughs> whichever way it's facing is going to make you go that way. 
And it's going to make you keep on going until you hit a wall or hit one of those yellow things. So you, like, have to go a certain way. But it's really not that hard to figure out. So I'm going to go ahead and try and get all the items first before I move on. We got a TM-12, which is Taunt. It's not really that good of a move, so I'm not going to teach it anything. And, uh... There's an item down here that I can get. So, I'll go ahead and get that. And it is a super potion. That's cool, but I'm not, I don't even need it, because I have lemonades. And I have to go all the way around now. Because it, like, forces you to go certain ways. And, uh... Yeah, that should do it. And, but... This elevator over here is, a. Uh, we can't use it yet until we get something called the lift key. And... Didn't even see him there. Intruder alert! But once we get the lift key, or... Pretty sure it's called the lift key. Uh, we can use it... How, uh, as much as we want. So... First one's a grimer. I really don't want to even bother, because... Pikachu, I mean, Raichu isn't going to do very good against Grimer. And that did, like, nothing. So I'll go ahead and use Dig. I can't wait until I get Earthquake. I don't really like Dig that much. But we're not going to get Earthquake until the very last gym. So until then, Dig will have to do. I mean, it's not a bad move. It has 60 power, but Earthquake is 100. It's just so much better. And coughing, I guess. I'll stay in. Cough. I hate coughing because I can't use dig on it. And I don't have any moves that are super effective against it. Poison types besides ground. And because of its levitate, I can't do anything. Wow, that literally did one hit point. And we'll take care of it with the thrash. And Bowser is up to level 30. Nice. And another coffee, and I don't want to get confused, so I'm going to and switch out to uh, Charmeleon. It's sort of close to evolving, so I guess I should train it. And Ember almost killed it. And thank god Poison Gas Miss. I really don't want to get poisoned right now. I'll just finish it off with the Scratch. Man, Team Rocket is so stupid. I mean, what what do they expect to get by just standing here all day? I mean, they're literally not doing anything. Except waiting for someone to uh, come and beat them. I mean, I mean, in in the show, like, uh, Jesse and James were like the only bad Team Rocket members. But, like, in the game, everyone's bad. It's just kind of weird. I don't know. I just always thought that was weird, because I don't really know why, but... Anyway, let's just go down here and find the lift key. See, I don't think I have to go down here just yet. So, let's see, there's nothing over here. Another one of these, uh, floor tile puzzles. Go ahead and get the items first. First one's a rare candy. I'm not going to be using them, because they don't really... Like, you don't, uh, get the... Uh, the boost that you normally would in like stats, like hit points and special attack, special defense, defense, you know, all that stuff. You don't get the same amount as you would if you level up actually battling. And I'm getting kind of lost here, but I'm pretty sure I know which way to go now. Uh, just go this way. And, uh, okay, I don't have to fight him. I'm like standing right in front of him, he doesn't even see me. And black glasses. This can be a pretty useful item if you have a, a dark type Pokemon, or just a Pokemon that knows a dark type move, like Bite or Crunch. You should give it to him because it'll power up dark type moves. And this is the guy that drops the lift key. But here's a TM for Snatch. That's not really a good move either. So, not really worth using. So, the elevator doesn't work. Who has the lift key? I really wonder who does have the lift key. But I guess we'll find out. Coughing, great. Like the most annoying Pokemon, I swear. Hopefully a Thunderbolt can take it out, just because it's such a beast move. 
and Pikachu, I mean, Pikachu, Raichu, has such good special attack. Thunderbolt's gonna do a lot of damage. And Zubat, this will be really easy to take out just because it's super effective. No worries. And we beat the Zubat. Got some experience, and we beat Team Rocket Grunt. No! Oh no, I dropped the lift key! <laughs> I don't understand how whenever he loses, he just drops it. And after he drops it, he doesn't bother picking it up. I don't know, that's stupid.